www.ghostbusinesscenter.com.au. This is our online home where you can find out so much more about our journeys. Sometimes people describe these sort of journeys to sacred sites, to ancient places as tours and for me they're not tours, they really are a kind of winding back a journey going into yourself while you venture into the landscape. An opportunity to really visit these iconic places that house the spirits, that house the ancestors and that also, I believe, are the home of part of your soul. So when we visit these places, no matter what seems to be happening on the surface, what's happening underneath is you are reclaiming aspects of yourself placing them back into your current lifetime and really walking forward and onwards from this journey with a renewed sense of who you are, your purpose on this planet at this time and a real feeling of belonging to a long and ancient tradition. The sacred sites that we visit include places as iconic, as legendary as Stonehenge where we often experience sunrise there is something about standing in the same place where your own ancestors have stood and doing very similar things to what they've done that is deeply stirring and deeply magical. We conduct rites and also conduct spellcrafting in different areas. Each site has a particular kind of energy and I've done a lot of work, a lot of research and a lot of time visiting them really wanting to learn their nature, their, their energies, their moods, so that when we walk in, we have the blessing of our ancestors. And that way we walk in with a sense of respect. And when we walk in with that, I, I do feel that we're often gifted great blessings in return. One of the places that we take you to is not on any map that you'll find and it is a place of birth and therefore when we go there we tend to do work around rebirthing a kind of rebirthing of yourself a renewal of your soul for that time we love to have a lot of joy a lot of laughter but we're also deeply mindful that every single individual's journey is going to be their own to take we support you with as much information as we possibly can. We also offer, I guess, support, a kind of community that can help. We have sharing circles virtually every day. And the extent to which you participate and really engage is the extent to which you will take away the blessings. We've experienced so much over these years and every single journey has been unique. There's a saying in Druidry which is you can never tell the same story the same way twice. So even though we might walk to the same places, we might journey to the same lands, we might visit Stonehenge again and again and again on a particular day at sunrise, it will never be the same experience for any two people. Every time I've returned, something else is given back to me. Jo Byrne, who I conduct these journeys with, is someone who I deeply respect. She's authentic, she's honest, she's a lot of fun. And she's someone who has really devoted herself to understanding the landscape and the geography of this sacred area of Wiltshire and Somerset. She also really understands crop circle phenomena and truly to understand this phenomena you need to spend the time. It is not as simple as walking into a circle. It is about community, it is about history, it is about symbology. And I feel that I've learned so much from this woman who's been so open and so sharing with so many people who've passed through our journeys. We've called this journey, this pilgrimage in Rama, and 
the reason that we've done this is because it's an ancient Celtic word, Irish in origin, that means a wonder voyage. Traditionally, it was taken over water. And traditionally, you went to somewhere, somewhere sacred, somewhere kind of difficult to get to. And when you went there, you were going to experience some kind of revelation, some kind of insight into yourself and usually a great deal of healing. It's our desire that your Imrama is an exciting journey. It's our belief that your Imrama will reclaim a part of your soul. And we know that your Imrama will take you to places that your soul has dreamt. Please enter this website, discover more, and if you feel the call, and if you hear her voice, please join us as we venture